This is Petaluma City Schools Technology Department with some tips on how to prepare your iPad for learning. Whether you've been using your iPad throughout the summer to continue learning or put it away to be stored safely, now is the time to get it ready for school. First off, you'll need to make sure that your iPad is fully charged. We recommend that you charge your iPad for at least four hours. One way to ensure that your iPad is fully charged is to plug it in overnight. Next, we recommend that you restart your iPad completely. To restart your iPad, go to the home screen, then hold the power button and the home button for five to 10 seconds. When the screen goes black and the Apple logo appears, your iPad is restarting. After restarting your iPad, we recommend that you close all open apps. To do this, double click the home button, then swipe up on the app windows like the video shows. Now that you've closed all open apps, we want to point out that we needed to apply a security update that prevents you from customizing the home screen and removing apps. Next, we are going to check the storage on your iPad to make sure that you have enough space for learning apps and activities. To check your storage, go to Settings, General, then find iPad Storage. First number you'll see shows how much storage you have used and the second number is how much is available. If that first number is almost as large as the second number, your iPad is nearly full. The easiest way to create space on your iPad is to back up your photos and videos to Google Drive, then delete them from the iPad itself. It's important to keep your iPad safe and clean. Always keep the case on your iPad and transport it carefully in a bag. Keep it away from food and drink. Do not put any stickers on the iPad or the case. Use a soft microfiber cloth to clean it. The last step in preparing your iPad for learning is updating the iOS. To do this, go to Settings, General, then Software Update. If there is an update available, select Download and Install, then follow the prompts. Students can get help with their iPads from the technology department by visiting the knowledge base at the PCS help desk or by sending an email to helpdesk at petk12.org or by submitting a ticket through the help desk portal. If you send an email, please be sure to include the student's full name, school, and a description of the problem. Well, that concludes our tips for preparing your iPad for learning. We wish you all a wonderful school year.